channel. Today I am going to be doing a video on my bag charm collection. I love bag charms. I think it brightens up my day. I think it makes my Louis Vuitton, you know, just pop. Because, uh, you know, as you guys know, a lot of the Louis Vuittons, the canvas one, just doesn't have a lot of color at times. And it just, I feel like this elevates it and it actually makes me happy. So just to add that pop of color. So let me go ahead and show you my uh, bag charm collection and also what it looks like on some of my bags. So without further ado, here we go. Well, I do have three pom-poms, you guys. They look so adorable and I love these pieces. This is the one that I use the least. I just, I don't know, it's black. I just feel like it doesn't do much for my bags, but these three over here are the ones that I use the most. It's so soft. This one here, I actually um, get compliments on this one the most on YouTube and in person. I don't use my bag charms really on any other bags except for my Louis Vuittons because I just feel like it doesn't look as good on them as they do on my uh, Louis Vuitton. So I don't add anything to, you know, my Chanel or my Gucci or my Prada. So, so anyways, let me go ahead and show you what these three look like on some of my bags here. Okay. So as you guys know, this is like one of my favorite, all time favorite bags, you guys. I so highly recommend this bag and this bag. These are stunning bags. Okay. And you put charms on them and just completely elevates it. Like, look how cute that looks like. I just think it's so pretty. It just completely just adds so much. Look at that. I do use this bag charm a lot with this bag. It just goes so well and match. Let me show you what the pink one looks like on. Look at that. Look how pretty that looks. I don't use the pink one or the red one too much because I just feel like the um, this one here just looks so pretty on it, so I don't always use it. And let me show you what the red one looks on this bag. Now that looks cute with the red and the black. I just think that looks stunning. So definitely it adds uh, to my outfit. And look, it kind of matches this. So anyways, let me go ahead and show you my next bag charms. Now those were my pom-poms. Oh, by the way, this one's Michael Kors. People do ask me about them. I don't see that Michael Kors sells them anymore. You might want to go on Amazon to find this because I do, I have seen it on there or things that are similar. You no, know, check it out. Go on Amazon. Okay, my next bag charms, you guys. These are my Louis Vuitton bag charms. I have three here. I love these. This is one of my favorites. When I first got this, I wasn't sure if I liked it because it hooked onto things. I just think I had a bad week that week because I haven't had this bag charm hook onto anything else. And this, oh my goodness, I love this piece. They still sell this one and um, if I would buy this one all over again. This right here, I use this awful lot. I just think it's so cute, but I only use this on my Dame Azur bag and it looks just stunning on my bag. One more new one you guys from Louis Vuitton and I talked about this in my reveal in the video. I will link it up on top if you guys want to see that. I mainly got this because it is just so cute. My mouse right there is carrying a um, Speedy. It's just a doll. So let me go ahead and show you uh, what these look like on my bag. How beautiful that looks. Sometimes I'll add another charm to it. I just think it adds so much. It's so cute. It just, I don't know. I can be sitting in my car and my bag be laying in my chair and I can look over and it'll just put this huge smile on my face. It just makes me so happy. And also what I like to wear with my Dame Azor, I haven't used it on my Dame Azor yet because I just got this bag charm, is also my little Chinese New Year's mouse. I just got this, so I have not been able to use it on my Dama Azor, but it is my plan to do that. I do want to get one more Dama Azor. If you guys looked at my wish list, I'll put it right up here. Uh, it is a Speedy 25 Bandolier. Eventually, I will get it, but that is a piece that is on my wish list, and I would like to get it. Okay, so let me show you. 
this looks on my bag here. Look how cute that is. And I also, I use this bag charm actually a lot on this bag here, this one here, because I thought it looked so pretty. And, um, and I use this one a lot. Look how cute that is. It just adds a little bit. And then sometimes I'll add one on one side and one on the other, just so it'll look cute on both sides. I will do a review on this bag. I need to do one because, oh my goodness, I, I love this piece. Okay, let me show you what my bag charm will look on this cutie here. It looks amazing with this. And never tried this one before, my brand new one, but oh my goodness. That is so cute, you guys. This bag charm looks amazing with that. Uh, what I've been using on my bag, on this bag, is this piece because I just think it just looks adorable. Hi, you guys. This is one of my favorite, favorite bags. This is my Tornell MM. It comes with a long strap and shoulder. It's got a front pocket zip. And I used this bag charm so much on this bag. This is actually my favorite bag charm. But now that I got this one, I will be using this one a lot also on my bag. Probably not as much as uh, this one here because I feel like this one looks really cute. Sometimes I'll hang it here on the zipper, which I do love. And then once in a while, I'll hang a pom-pom on here. You know, I play with it and you can just put it anywhere you like just to have fun and it just adds so much to your plain um, brown bag. Look, it's color treated and it's not even hard. It's not stiff. It is just, it's, it's a great bag. I don't know if I like that on there. I can put it here. See, that doesn't look bad on the back. So I would probably mainly use it back here. Okay, the mouse one looks adorable, so I probably would use that as well. I, but that does look so cute on there because it's got the monogram, so it has that nice contrast. I don't think the contrast is big enough. I don't know. I'll play with it when the time comes for me to wear this. Sometimes I'll hang something like this. It is from Victoria's Secret. It's like a little deal and I put my business cards in there and sometimes a tiny pin. And this has been so cute. I actually got compliments on this. I, it didn't cost me but $16. So I have used that on that bag and also this bag, which I use often. Look at that, look how cute that is. So I do have two other ones. Well, I have this one also from Victoria's Secret. It's really cute. I don't know if I've used this one yet. I've had it for a while, and I have used this one on my Alma. So that's more of the bag charms that I have here. That's it for my bag charm. I did buy this pretty thing here to hang my bag charms on. It was black, and I decided to spray it and make it gold, and I just thought, this is just so, so cute. And I just put my bag charms on just like this. I just hang them all on here. I'm hoping to get one other thing from Louis Vuitton. It's kind of like a bag charm. I'm not sure if I'll be able to get it. They said it's out. My essay says he doesn't even know if I'll be able to get it. I don't even want to say it, okay? So I don't even want to say it because I am waiting for that thing. And I want it, I want it. So uh, anyways, I will let you guys go. Happy 2020. You guys enjoy your day and God bless you. Bye.